um, you know, that's not actually legal. So uh, the question is, what is incitement to violence? And I think, um, you know, posting swastikas in, in what is obviously not a, you know, good way uh, is an incitement to violence. I, I personally wanted to punch uh, Kanye, so uh, that, would, that was definitely inciting me to violence. Um, Hello, my friends. So welcome back to this channel. As usual, your host, Peter. This is Voiku Family Channel. Let's talk uh, about Elon Musk. Elon Musk and uh, once upon a time his friend. What's his name? A. Kenny West. Kenny West. Let's call him Kenny West. Kenny West, uh, he lost his ways. I am uh, somewhere very close to say that he lost his mind as well. How would you explain uh, his uh, latest interview on Alex Jones' uh, show? Alex Jones was the one that seemed to be right in his mind. So can you imagine if Alex Jones was the one that was right in his mind? Then uh, that speaks volumes. Kanye West speaking about Hitler. Kanye West uh, praising Hitler and Nazis. And Kenny West posting on his Twitter a swastika. That was too much, absolutely too much for uh, Elon, Elon Musk. So Elon Musk uh, suspended his account permanently, it seems. And I think it's permanently this time. Because uh, Kenny posted yes, that Elon uh, Musk, he actually admits that he wanted to punch Kenny. It was too much. The fact that he posted that swastika was, uh, I don't know, asking for it according to Elon. Now, with all this drama between Elon and Kenny West, uh, they used to be close friends. Well... At least friends, let's not put it this way. Maybe it's a bit of a stretch to say close friends, but they were friends. And now he suspended his account and it seems that Kenny is on a, a journey to self-destroy. Since uh, his wife divorced him, he is not the same man anymore. You can see that clearly with open eyes. He is losing it. Day by day he gets worse and worse. Let's pray for both of them. Let's pray for Kenny. I already utter a prayer in one of my videos for him. Because he doesn't need our condemnation. Easily we can condemn someone. It's easy to point fingers to others. But uh, the challenge comes when uh, we pray. When we love those that are unlovable. Nobody is unredeemable. God can change and redeem anyone. All Kenny needs to do is to come to Jesus, honest, sincere. And when it's about Elon, well, Elon in the past flirted with the idea of being a Christian himself. He just flirted with it. I remember when he was on Babylon B, he went uh, to meet uh, those lovely people from Babylon B or an interview. And uh, the interviewers they were actually putting him uh, in a spot in which um, asking him about are you interested in becoming a christian <laughs> what stops you from saying yes to christ right now and uh, elon musk look at them and uh, he told them that uh, he, he doesn't stop christ from changing lives that he agrees with what christ is doing but that was uh, his way of saying that he's not really interested. So let's pray for both of them that God, that Jesus will work in their heart. And both of them, they will accept Jesus. And every single person will consider the offer of salvation that is only through the blood of Jesus. How amazing it is, isn't it? Friends, this is my channel. This is my take. Christian vlogger, Christian YouTuber. I will not waste any occasion to bring the name of Jesus on the limelight. The name that matters. The only name that can make a difference. The only name that can bring redemption, forgiveness, a new beginning. And I want for both of them, Elon Musk and Kanye West, to meet Jesus and them to change their life. 
Elon has so much money and influence, but I don't see him the most happy person. He has、uh, already broken relationships in his life. He has his share of pain and sorrow. I don't see him so happy. You know what, friends? The secret of happiness is to have Jesus. You might believe this or not, but that doesn't affect the validity of what I'm saying. That's my comment. God bless you. Thank you so much for watching, and up to next time. Stay close to Jesus, the only source of joy, happiness, peace, and a new beginning. See you soon, friends. The music I will not forget to mention is from White Bat Audio, Carl Casey. And if you love what I'm doing, oh, please don't forget to smack the subscribe button. See you soon, friends.